Hello friends, in this video I'm going to talk about uh, converting from one unit of area to the other unit of area. So the different units of area that uh, you should be knowing or you may have seen if, uh, is one is meter squared, you've got centimeter squared, then you've got meter squared, you can have kilometer squared and you can have hectares. Okay. So let me let us understand what is what are what is the meaning of these units. Suppose let us talk about one. What does if someone is saying uh, what is one meter, one millimeter squared? Now uh, you should know these unit conversions of length. Say one centimeter is say ten millimeter. Okay. Uh, then you can you have one meter is hundred centimeter cent stand for uh, say centi is always for cent is always for hundred hundred centimeter okay and uh, one kilometer kilo stands for thousand is one thousand meters and one hectare is 10,000 meters squared. Now these are the units of length. Uh, these are the units of length and this is a unit of area. Okay, so this is one group and this is, these are the facts that you should know. Okay, one centimeter is accepted, accepted to be 10 millimeter. So I've drawn a square so I want to explain what does one centimeter, how much is one centimeter. Now this is not exactly to scale so this suppose if you imagine this is a square of one millimeter by one millimeter one millimeter by one millimeter so the area enclosed by this tiny square of one millimeter length and one millimeter width is one millimeter times one millimeter so when you're multiplying uh, units and of course this is you multiply the numbers and you also multiply the units so this is one 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 times one is one and millimeter times a millimeter is one millimeter squared this is how you write okay so one millimeter squared is nothing but if someone is asking you can you explain one millimeter squared it's nothing but the area occupied by a square of one millimeter by one millimeter. If you can, if you say one area of uh, area of a square occupied, uh, sorry, uh, one millimeter square means it's the area occupied by a square of one millimeter. Okay, you don't need to say one millimeter by one millimeter. So when you're saying square, it means all the sides are equal. So suppose this is a slightly bigger. Again, this is not drawn to scale. So, so if the this is a square of one centimeter, so if I say it's a square of one centimeter, it means the length and the width are one centimeter. So let me change color. So this the area occupied by this square of one centimeter is one centimeter times one centimeter, which is one centimeter squared. Okay, so this area or this place. Uh, space occupied by this square is one centimeter squared. Now this is a bigger square. Again, this is not drawn to a scale. So this is a square of one meter. So if the length is one meter, the width is also one meter. So this area that this square occupies in space is called one meter squared. Okay, one meter by one meter is one meter squared. And finally, this is say one kilometer by one kilometer. Okay, so in terms of meters, this is 1,000 meters times 1,000 meters. So this you can say it's one kilometer squared, which is same as 1,000 meters times 1,000 meters. 1,000 times 1,000 is 
uh, six zeros. So you put. So how many? How do you read this? This is one million uh, meter squared. Okay, and this is how many uh, hectares? So one hectare. So this is how many thousand? How many ten thousand? So it has got how many? Ten thousand. Okay, so ten thousand has how many zeros? Five zeros. So let me underline five zeros. Okay, so this is so it, this can be written as ten times ten thousand. Ten, th ten times ten thousand meter squared. Does it make sense? Okay, so this is 10 hectares. Okay, so this is, this has got 10 lots of 10,000 meters squared. So this one kilometer is nothing but 10 hectares. Okay, so I think having said that, let us go and do these conversions. So the first question is, you want to convert this 20 centimeters squared into millimeter squared. Now students, do get confused to how would you convert this you can remember formulas uh, of conversion but that's uh, I don't like remembering formulas so I would say okay I want to change this into millimeter squared so what is 20 centimeter squared so 20 centimeter squared is say 5 centimeter uh, okay I should write suppose this is not drawn to scale so this is four cent. Suppose this is four centimeter, and say this is five centimeter. Okay. So this is a rectangle, or uh, the area of this rectangle is five centimeters times four centimeters, which is twenty centimeter squared. Okay. And now I want to change this into millimeter squared. So basically, what you do is you change this into centimeters. So you know one centimeter is 10 millimeters so 5 centimeter would be 50 centimeter times 40 centi sorry 50 millimeters 5 centimeters is 1 centimeter is 10 millimeters so 5 centimeters should be 50 millimeters times 40 millimeters Okay, so just multiply the numbers. So let me write it like this. So it's 50 times 40 in one bracket times, uh, or don't write times, and let me put this in a different bracket, millimeter times millimeter. Okay, so this is 50 times 40 is 2,000, and millimeter times millimeter is millimeter squared. So... 20 centimeter squared is nothing but 2,000. Am I right? Yes, 2,000 millimeter squared. Okay. Let me look. Let's look at one more question. 54 centimeter squared is how many millimeter squared? Again, good strategy would be to take any square or rectangle. So think of two numbers which multiplies to give you 54. You can take any two numbers, okay? So 27 times 2 is fine, uh, or 9 times 6 is 54, okay? So this is a 6 centimeter, and this is 9 centimeter. So this is nothing but 90 millimeters, and this is 60 millimeters. So 54 centimeters squared, I'm saying it is 9 centimeter times 6 centimeter, or you can write 6 centimeters times 9 centimeter, doesn't make any difference, which is nothing but 990 millimeter times 60 millimeter. So I multiply the numbers, so 9 times 5 is 54, then I have to put two zeros, and millimeter times millimeter is millimeter squared. Okay, so the answer is. 5,400 millimeter squared. Okay. Now here, oh, I had, this should be into millimeter squared. This is in millimeter squared. Uh, 
Okay. Mm. Yeah. Centimeters to millimeters. Yeah. Okay. Now let us change this into say meter squared. Let us make it different. So a bit more challenging. So 120 centimeter. So again, draw a rectangle. So it's not drawn to dimension. So here 120 can be 10 times 12. So let's me let's this is 10 centimeters and this is 12 centimeters. I want to change this into meters. So one centimeter. So let me write this here. One meter is hundred centimeter. Okay. So one centimeter. So one centimeter is one out one over hundred meter. So one centimeter is one hundredth of a meter. So if one centimeter is one hundredth of a meter, twelve centimeters is twelve hundredth of a meter. Okay, and twelve hundred is zero point one two meters. In the same logic, one centimeter is one hundred, so ten centimeters would be ten hundred or one tenth. That is very logical. One tenth of a meter, which is zero point one meter. Okay, so I can say one twenty centimeters. So by if when you're doing like this, you don't have to remember anything. Just you need to know the rem, uh, basic facts. Is same as 12 centi. Sorry, not 120. It's 12 centimeters times 10 centimeters. And we just saw that 12 centimeter is 0 0.12 meter times. Always write the unit times 0 0.1 meter. So you can use a calculator. But here, basically, when you're multiplying decimals, this is basically multiplying 12 times 1 is 12. And here you got uh, this. You got two numbers out of the decimal point. So this is 2 plus 1. So you put a placeholder of 0 here. So 0 point. I'll show this on a calculator. So meter times meter is meter squared. So it is 0 0.012 meter squared. So just to explain this last step. So those for those who are not confident in fractions, sorry, decimal. So this is 0 0.12 times 0 0.1, which is 0 0.012. And at the same way, 12 divided by 100 is, sorry, 12 divided by 100 is 0 0.12. Okay. So let us move on. Let us do a few more questions. So here this is 420,000 centimeters squared. Okay, so this is slightly challenging. So this is, I'm making a, so I'm saying this is 420 centimeters and this is 1,000 centimeters. Okay, because 420 times 1,000 gives you 420,000. So let me show you that. So how did it take? You can take any numbers that multiplies to give you this. So 420 times 1000 is, oh sorry, 1000. So 420 times 1000 is 420,000. Okay, now this I want to change this into meters. So this is how many meters? Uh, one, this is 400 meters is Sorry, 400 centimeters is uh, 4 meters. So this is 4.2 meters. Does, does it make sense? 100 centimeter. 100 centimeter is 1 meter. So 400 centimeter is 4, centimeter, 4 meters. And 20 centimeter is 20 out of 100 meters. Okay, which is 0 0.2 meters. I hope this is clear. So this is this has got how many hundred centimeters? You've got 10. So this is this has got 10 hundred centimeters. Okay, so this is nothing but 10 meters. So this is 10 meters is 
10 meters yeah 10 meters is 100 1000 centimeter so let me write this so 420,000 centimeters squared is 420 centimeter times 1000 centimeter always good to show the working I don't like students to remember the formula so this is 4.2 meters times 10 meters okay so just to so 10 meters 1 meter is 100 centimeters so 10 times 100 is 1000 okay so now to do this you can use a calculator you can do without the calculator but 4.2 times 10 can you tell the what the answer 4.2 times 10 would be 42 so it is 42 meter squared 42 meter squared because meter times meter is meter squared I'll do one more video of conversions uh, see you in the next video